Right out six, imagine thinking you have insurance to protect your home and property, then suddenly it vanishes when you need it the most. A local man says that nightmare came true when Hurricane Barrel tore through his home. I pay for insurance. I don't mind paying for insurance, but when you get dropped like that, it just makes you upset. Good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm Keith Garvin. And I'm Andy Sirota. Daniela Guzman is off tonight. The homeowner has lived in this house for 23 years and had his insurance policy for two years. However, in recent months, they asked him to do something he couldn't. KPRC 2's Rowan Belogan is in Northeast Houston explaining why that man's insurance company dropped him. In March, Mr. Cooper's insurance, who he's been with for two years, told him to replace the roof. He didn't because he said he didn't have any issues with it. Then his insurance dropped him. Then Hurricane Barrel hits. Second was here. We had landed across this, uh, these two little peaks and landed there. You can see where the tree was right there. Wilbur Cooper shows us the damage Hurricane Barrel left to his home. He's deciding whether to take out a loan or pay out of pocket after his insurance dropped him. But they still had me pay up until May. If you was gonna just drop me, just drop me and don't take my money. But, you know, I guess that's the way they work. Cooper was dropped from his policy because he didn't replace his roof. Home and car insurance was the focus of an Ask Amy episode with Leash U, where he discussed roofs. They could say, hey, if your roof is older than one year, mm -hmm. uh, we're not interested. Uh, most of them look at like maybe a 10 year period of time, but the older the roof gets, uh -huh. the, the harder it is to insure. You said if you can't find coverage, consider calling your lender. They will activate force place insurance, which will only cover collateral. But know this, it's pricey. Head over to click2houston.com to watch the full episode of Ask Amy. See, I done been through all these storms that done came through. I can say I'm blessed because I didn't have, I didn't get any damage out of none of those storms, you know. But this windstorm come through and just tap everything. If you don't want to call a lender, you can apply for FEMA assistance. Look, I know I just put out a lot of information for you, but we have all of this and more on click2houston.com. I'm Roman Belogan, KPRC 2 News.